Hey guys, what's up? Shin055, back more, let's play, uh, Mega Man X. Um, hopefully this will be a short video. I'm not gonna fight the last level yet, because there's still a few things that I need to get. Again, why no storm tornado? Guys, you're dropping the ball. Yeah, it's my viewer's responsibility to remind me I need to equip storm tornado. Anyway, we're back in flaming mammoths level. Mainly because I love this place, not really. But, um, you see those brick tiles over there? We are going to, um, get up there. And to do so, you need to dash and jump at the most precise time. Like, it is ridiculous how hard this thing is. Ah, damn, almost got it. Oh, you jump, Mega Man. There we go. That was actually really easy. I'm surprised I got on the first shot. But in this capsule, this uh, body part contains the uh, X Buster upgrade. And we can do a whole different types of crazy stuff now. Which I will demonstrate. We'll jump in. Bam! Okay, now we play as X. Now I will start calling Mega Man by his, uh, Mega Man X. Just by X now. Because he is X. Alright, anyway. You can charge up your gun and get that shot. It's like a purple. Because you get a green one, a yellow one, a blue one, and then... The pinkish purple one. Also... You get, say, I use Storm Tornado. If you charge the gun up all the way, you get an upgraded uh, attack. And that's all that's here for this video. Um, yes. So we exit the stage successfully. And I'm going to show you how to get the last heart tank. And then we can get the super hidden... Weapon of awesomeness. That is, uh... The hidden weapon in this game. It kills everything in one hit. So, I know that sounds a little overpowered, but, uh... But, uh, you actually need full life to use it. Um, those who played Mega Man X probably know about this. It's not that hidden of a secret. Bam, look at that. I think I did that last time. Okay, wait. Rolling shield. Charge it up all the way. You get this shield around you. And what it does is it actually blocks laser attacks and kills flying small enemies. So literally, you can get through this part without getting hit. The only downside to it is you can't attack. So, uh, if you want, you, I usually do this in the pause menu because you can't do it in any other way. And just use a storm tornado. Look at him trying to hit me while I'm cl climbing up the ladder. Thinks he's so special. Alright, anyway, let's go. Oh, another good reason to use the rolling shield. Charge it up all the way, and bam. Now you just have to avoid the spikes, but the flying guys don't hurt you. Or though, yeah, it's the flying guys. In uh, Mavic Hunter X, um, I think like those spiral wheels drop on you. Oh, yeah. I, I believe. Ma if you don't know, Mavic Hunter X is... Uh, the, they remade this game for the PSP, and uh, it's called Mavic Hunter X. That's about, that's really about it. This part is so much easier with the rolling shield equipped, mainly because you don't have to wait for those stupid machines anymore. You can just kind of go at your own pace. See? Look how much easier that is. 
That is ridiculous. Okay, there's the last heart tank, and to get it, you will need to switch to the boomerang cutter. You have to back up a little bit. Da -na 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 -na. Now I have a bigger health bar than the bosses do, actually. And exit. So now you officially got every power up in Mega Man X. Well, not everyone. You got all of them except the uh, Mega Super Awesome attack. And to get this attack, it's actually kind of hard. But um, you have to play Armored Armadillo stage. I'm going to show you how to do it, but you actually have to do this five times. Um, what I like to do is charge the Chameleon Sting all the way. Okay, wait, let me explain what you have to do first. First, you have to beat this entire level, a hundred, like, all of it, a hundred percent, without getting hit, and then you need to do a special jump at the end. So what I do, I charge the Chameleon Sting all the way, and then when this is about to go, I dash and let go of it. So you gotta go through all these enemies. Like that. And then, um... Time for the rolling shield to do its work. And then I equip the rolling shield. Charge it up all the way. I'm playing it safe, so I activate this guy. And these guys can't hurt you anymore. Uh, wait for the hard hats to come up and then dash forward. Um, bam. Just like that. Because if you touch them while they're in their, uh... While they're hidden under their hat, um, you lose the rolling shield, which sucks. And then you get hit. I found this is the easiest way to do it. Um, yeah, you can just run through all these things. Look out, because there's little hard hats, and if you're not paying attention, you probably run into them. And just be careful when you get on this cart, because, uh, you could, uh, ooh. Alright, that was scary. Apparently, he hit me somehow. Fall all the way to the right, so you, you activate this guy and he goes forward. While, uh, X just chills out here and, um, yeah, just lets it happen. See if you uh if he if you don't kill him before he gets to this point you can't get up there, which sucks. And then you won't be able to get a heart tank. Okay, this part. Oh, I effed up. God damn it. Yeah, I recommend. What? Okay, I really screwed up this time. I don't think the axes can hurt you, but... Oh, that... That was just terrible. That... That was just terrible. You know what? I'm gonna just take the hits. Um, mainly because I can. There we go. He's dead. Okay. S new tip. Stand all the way at the end here. So when you're going through those guys, because you accidentally might hit. And you need to get up here. That's basically the thing. And then when you go down... That was terrible. I'm so pissed off right now. But then you get up there where that health is. You do this five times without getting hit. And then a uh, hidden item... Like the hidden item pops up. Anyway, well, that's all for me. Um, next video, I think I'll open up with uh, getting the new hidden power up and uh, starting Sigma's Palace. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you found it helpful, because we did a lot. And next video, we will get the super hidden technique, if you will. Um, 
and then go on to fight the last bosses of Sigma's Palace. Alright guys, thank you very much for watching, hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you next time. Alright guys, bye bye.